So um, as you went on and you had the anesthesia, it's actually three days, and a lot of patients have told me, wow, and I, don't, I mean, I'm going to go under anesthesia for three days. Does it seem to get tougher? Does it seem to get easier um, as you, you know, do the second and third day? What would you say? Well, going there the second day was easier mm -hmm. because I knew what was going to take place, and when I got there, all the same people were there, and that made you feel comfortable. Um, and as far as the anesthesia, it seemed to be faster, easier, woke up faster, I wasn't sleepy, I went out to lunch, did a little shopping, um, and didn't even want to take a nap, I wasn't sleepy, and I did not feel groggy, it was, there was no feeling that I had been drugged. And so you didn't take a nap because you didn't want to? No. And you felt like going out? I was out. wide awake. And yeah. you went out to lunch with your sister or something yeah. that order, had fun? Yep, we and did. Yep. yep. Good deal. Yep. We came back and I had a normal, perfectly great night sleep and I was feeling less pain already. Excellent. Yeah. And so one of the things that you had just said that interests me because I, I really want to see this from the patient's perspective is the fact that you said we well, didn't really know what's going to go on the first day. So can we talk about that? I mean, mm -hmm. what does go on the first day that maybe I didn't tell you about or that you would like someone to know so that they're not so afraid to be there the first day? Well, um, it's, it's a hospital environment. You're mm -hmm. going to get those bright lights and you're going to get everybody in masks and um, the hospital gear. And the hats. And it's a little scary for some people. Mm -hmm. You know, when you see all these people walking around and then you're wheeled into the OR <laughs> and you have the bright lights, the cool temperature, and everybody with the wires, that stuff. Mm -hmm. You know, that's probably the worst of it, but everybody is so nice in there. You, you know, they have these conversations going on and you wish you didn't have to go to sleep so you could keep talking. <laughs> yeah, that is the nice thing. Yeah. And it, the, it is like a hospital environment, but it's a surgical center. Right. And of course the wires that you're talking about are the EKG yep. leads that are yep. just snapped on. And then uh, the doctor tells you when he's going to, and they give you oxygen. Mm -hmm. And then he also tells you when he's going to give you the medication. Mm -hmm. And you feel that and pretty much you yawn and you go to sleep. Right. Oh, immediately. Immediately. Yeah. And easily. Right, and then um, you know that you were only out for 15 minutes. I know. And then the second and the third day, 12 minutes. Yeah. Right, and that's how good it went. But let's talk about some of the results you got. I mean, uh, you are totally willing to let me adjust you in the office when you're not under anesthesia. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's talk about like what you felt like before you went in or the results that you got. What, what is the biggest result that you got? The biggest result is I have no more lower back pain. Amazing. That's great. It is amazing. I mean, I couldn't get out of my car after a drive, and I always I anticipated that, and I don't get that anymore. Or standing up for a longer period of time, no backache. Walking for at the end of a long walk, no backache. I mean, that's gone. The only aches I have are muscle stretch aches, like like a workout stretching. Mm -hmm. And now, is that from the procedure or from the stretches that we're having you do? It was, in your it was from the procedure mm -hmm. when I, I felt my legs and I, I said, um, oh, they must have stretched those muscles because it felt like I had been um, doing exercises. And you were. Yeah. I guarantee you, I yeah. was there. <laughs> I'm glad I was. Yeah, that's fantastic. <laughs> and I didn't have to go through all the work. And thank you so much because it's just, I like my patients to hear from other patients mm -hmm. so that they mm -hmm. don't have to have these big fears because really, right. Everybody that I've done, I've asked them about the anesthesia, I've asked them about it, and they said it was just not worth worrying about once they oh, had it done. Absolutely not. But you could tell them that it was a, a surgical environment, and what you really want. Yeah. You really want that. Yes, for that type of thing. Because, you know, you want that professionalism and that perfection. Right. We have a medical doctor, I we have know. an anesthesiologist, an anesthesiologist nurse practitioner, I know. Uh, a practical nurse, right. and then two to three chiropractors. Yeah. So you're. You're really getting a lot of personal attention. Huh? I know. And I do like that idea that you had your own nurse for three days. I know. That yeah. was excellent. Excellent. You could count on her to fulfill your needs at the time, you know, the little things that you might need. Good deal. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs>